So the ball moving again. The pendulum having already swung England's way. But we see more dazzling football from them in this second half. teammates to play it to. Walker. Here's Kane. Rice. Trot attempts it. He's always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. Brendan Aronson. Doesn't have to do it on his own. Uh, is this the moment? Oh, tremendous goalkeeping. But hang on, offside is the decision here. Bowden. A chance to whip it in. Walker. It might appeal to Raheem Sterling, you know. But here's the replay, and you can see why the manager is dealing with It's just really poor play. Over in that possession, far too easily in a dangerous area. And at this level, if we keep doing that, we're going to get punished. Just not good enough. It's been all England so far. You sense there could be extra punishment in store. All right, sorry for the pause, folks. I had to do something. But it's okay anyway, because we can continue the game. Apologies for the pause. So, Genio next. Chance to attack using wings. There's possession. Well, England have controlled possession, as you can see, and as a result, have dominated the game. Some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch, and I don't think anything's going to change that. Well, that's right, and unusually, they don't have the ball on this occasion. Once again, couldn't keep hold of it. Counter attacking, very much an option. Do they have the guile to open up the defence? And Bellingham gets it a go. Well, keeper in control. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. I'm a bit short for the clearance. And he did well to cut it out. And Bellingham, a real difficulty keeping the ball. Pereira, can they do something positive on the counter attack? It's there for him, and a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolutely stunning save there. That is brilliant. Substitution time as is here. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, getting in the way, superb save. Another corner. And a super header. It looked as though it might be going in. We're trying to build ahead of Steve. Another corner of the day. Able to deal with the threat. No play stopped. It is a free kick. And the substitution will occur now. As I for goal! 
and never at any time from the keeper. Might really be able to trouble them here. And Bellingham, now with Matt. And that's an important intervention. Now we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Raya. Sterling. Walker now. Foden. Rice. Takes aim. And the referee has given them a corner. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. He's driven in the corner. Quite did his job defensively. And Sterling has it. Here's Kane being egged on by the crowd. Foden. On to Mount. Body in the way. And possession given away. Well, a very effective play in possession, but nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Weyer. And we've entered the final five minutes. Walker. And making sure nothing untoward happened following the cross. Rice. And now Sterling. Shaw. Now with Max. Foden. Oh, a smart stop. Playing the other. And clearing his away. A tiny challenge. Well, that was now to nullify the opposition. And there goes the final whistle. Very acceptable from an England point of view. A victory here. Stuart, your thoughts on that performance? You're absolutely right there. Their attacking play was excellent, full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all round performance. And the shining light for his team, no two ways about that, Harry Kane. Yeah, not much more you could ask for, really. Plenty of effort, a goal, and most importantly, the right result. He should be happy with today. It's finished here in Qatar for the, for the night. England 3, United States 0. Okay. Right. Well, this is well. It's finished here in this game. So yeah. So England win. Surely now they're going to go to the group stages. I meant mean, to the knockout stages of the um the FIFA World Cup. The player of the match is Luke Shaw. Luke Shaw. Player of the match is Luke Shaw. So Luke Shaw is man of the match. So, the man of the match with 8.2, is it? Yeah, 8.2, because that's mirror mode on my camera a little bit, even though I'm recording. Uh, 8.2 with play of match of the player of the match award is Luke Shaw. So, Luke Shaw is man of the match. Well played to him. Okay, so it's finished now.